welcome to Flock Live. For those of you who are new here, I'm Emily. This is Bogey, and welcome to our channel. We post once a week on basically everything bird related. So today's video is gonna be a how to roll over tutorial and we're very excited for it. So the funny thing about Bogey with rollover is that he only rolls left. And all he had to do was turn left. What do you mean? I'm not an ambi-turner. It's a problem I had since I was a baby. I can't turn left. So I was thinking of reteaching him roll over to roll right and I could film it and show you guys what I do. So for this tutorial, you're gonna need treats. You're gonna need your bird. You are gonna need a bridge. So whether that's a clicker or a, a specific word that tells your bird it's doing the right thing, I have clickers, but I always forget to take it out. So my bridge is yes. He's like, where's my treat? And you're gonna want a comfortable surface for your bird to roll on. Typically, your bird will be more comfortable on a blanket or towel, something where they're not slipping around. And the key to this tutorial is that it will take a little bit of time. It took Bogey about two weeks to learn rollover. And this was with me training him pretty much every day, short training sessions but just little bits a day will get them to where they need to be and then soon they'll just be rolling over left and right. Let's get started. Okay, so you roll this way. So there you go. Okay, come here. So the first step in training your bird how to roll over is to get them to touch your finger. Yes, and right when they do, give them a treat. So you're gonna wanna repeat this step until they got it. Obviously, Bogey knows what he's doing, so he's gonna comply. So once they have mastered that, you're gonna tip them slightly. And I'm not even doing the correct reward, but I will. So tip, yes, good boy. Yes. Your bird's gonna be a little bit confused and will cling to the surface he or she is on, so make sure what you're using to train on is a comfortable surface where your bird can grip. Please take this nice and slow, guys. Being on one's back is a very unnatural behavior for most birds, so it's gonna take some time and trust for your bird to perform. The next step yes. is to get your bird's Good shoulder boy. to make contact with the ground. In order to do this, make sure your bird is totally comfortable with the tilting and tilt until his or her wing oh. makes contact with the ground. Stop. Right when the wing makes contact, use your bridge and yes. reward with a treat. Good boy. Step four is full back contact. Make sure you let your bird cling to your fingers. I like to gently direct Bogey to fully roll over. Start slow, and of course, don't force your bird to do anything he or she is uncomfortable with. Notice how I include a hand signal into the training session. Keep in mind that this is a sped up process since Bogey already knows how to do this trick. Bogey went from wing tap to laying on his back very quickly, and this might not be the same for you and your bird. The more and more you do this exercise, the more confident your bird will become and he or she will need your finger at less and less. Just be patient and keep up the good work. So at this point, I'm barely helping Bogey lean over. I'm keeping my fingers there as a support and I help him out about 20%. The rest of the work is all him. I also don't reward him unless he fully rolls over, even if that means he still needs a little bit of help. Boy. Step five is solo finger support. The reason why I call it this is because your bird is almost there, but not quite. Let your finger be a support. Have them grip onto your finger and then use your hand signal to indicate that you want your bird to roll over. Once they see the hand signal, they'll want to try to roll over. Keep your finger down where it is and let them do it all by themselves. If your bird is really struggling with this, go back to step four and practice that more. Sorry guys, it's hard to film. I tried to switch up the angle, and as you see, I didn't move my hand to help him. I just leave my finger there, let him hold on, 
and he kind of does all the rest himself. You can't see it because I'm trying to film, but I am also doing my hand signal and it kind of shows him which direction he should go for the rollover. And I also have the treat in my hand when I'm doing my signal. So he kind of follows the treat, which naturally tips him all the way over. And soon enough, guys, your bird is barely gonna even need your finger to flip over. Wait for it. Wait for it. Bam. He just flipped over without using my finger at all. And this is because we took each step slowly and we built his confidence. Don't forget to give your bird a jackpot reward the first couple times he or she flips over without your help to solidify this trick. Here's for the moment of truth. Roll right. Good boy, Bogey. Good boy. Now roll left. Yes. Good. One look. One look. I don't think so. Bogey is now an ambi turner. He can turn both left and right. I am so proud of him. I think this is a big accomplishment and I hope you guys enjoyed our video. I really hope this does help. Training such an important part of owning a parrot. I hope you guys have a lot of fun with it and I hope your parrots do too. Bo, come here. Bo, roll. Okay, that's roll left. No, roll right. Roll. Roll right. Yay! Good boy, Bobo. Give him a little jackpot. It's still hard for him, you guys. He still wants to roll left. It's so cute. Come here. Come, not that, that. Come here. Okay, ready? Over here. Roll right. <laughs> roll right. Roll right. Yes, good boy. Now roll left. Good boy, Bogey. Roll right. Nope, roll right. Yep, nope. Come here. Roll right. Nope, right. Yes, good boy. Okay, Bo, moment of truth, buddy. You guys, moment of truth. Bogey, roll right. Wow, good boy. I'm so proud of him. Okay, and now roll left. Yay, oh my goodness. Good job, Bo. Let's do it one more time, ready? Come over here, roll. Okay, that's left. Roll right, no, roll <laughs> roll right. Good boy, Bobo. You get two, that was crazy. Roll right, roll right. Roll right, good boy.